all right what's up guys so today we will probably be simulating the next couple games and we might even get to the playoffs depending on how it goes um so anyways the first game of today is against the seven and three patriots they are having a really good year and it should be a good game we're one game behind them uh, so this could decide some playoff stuff so we take the win over the Patriots. We scored in every quarter. It looks like it was a pretty close game. Uh, Travis Lakes had a his probably his best game so far, besides his last game probably. 236, two touchdowns, no interceptions. Uh, Julian Edelman had a big game. Tim Patrick had a really big game. Three for 90, two touchdowns. He had a 68 yarder, it looks like. And on defense... Von Miller had a sack, and nobody else from our team had a sack. And Von Miller had an interception, and Michael Ojemudie, he had another interception. He's had such a good year. So after that good game, Travis Lakes get an upgrade. Uh, I still think we want to focus on that second row of batch tributes. Um, but there's nothing right now that's super amazing. Um, so we'll just work on improviser again here. And... All right. So one guy I do definitely want to sign back is Will Parks. Uh, he's played really good for us, and he does accept it. Honestly, uh, us against the Raiders. We'll see if we can take this W here. I wanted to see the Raiders blow us out. The offense played terrible. The defense didn't play very well either. Derek Carr had a good game. Travis Lakes. Uh, he didn't throw an interception, so I'm not sure why we're so bad. Josh Jacobs had a huge game. Philip Lindsay played all right. Right now, we would be in as the sixth team. Uh, there's a three-way tie as it goes three really good teams, and then it drops off <laughs> to, to a bunch of teams at 7-5. and five. So right now, we're in. But we do learn one really interesting thing. Travis Lakes has superstar development. That is really good. He doesn't have X Factor, but superstar. He'll develop super fast now, hopefully. Um, and I think he could be probably our franchise quarterback. So the second half of the schedule is not forgiving at all. As we face another team with a winning record, the Buccaneers this time. They're in the NFC. Uh, but this is a really big game if we don't want to fall behind the Chargers and uh, Raiders. Uh, this is a really big game. Another really frustrating loss as the offense did not come to play today. Uh, well, we had two turnovers, which could definitely be the reason why. Um... Tom Brady played all right. Travis Lakes, this is a really bad game. By far his worst. 222, but two interceptions and no touchdowns. Even after that really bad game, he gets another upgrade. Uh, Travis Lakes, that is. And uh, we're going improviser again. Oh, 76 overall this time. Awareness, that's, that's pretty solid. Oh, and this is tough. Philip Lindsay suffers an injury that'll keep him out eight weeks. Uh, I'm gonna put him on the IR because we do need another spot for a running back. That is really big. So, a little bit of an easier game this week as we have the Chargers in week 17. I feel like we will play that game. Um, I assuming we win at least one of the two next games, we'll probably play that Chargers game. Um, but anyway, this is a little bit of an easier game for us. So hopefully we can take this dub against the Falcons. Another really bad performance by the offense. I don't know what's happening, but we're just not playing well. Uh, Matt Ryan played pretty good. Travis Lakes played all right. Uh, rushing, Melvin Gordon was really bad. Royce Freeman wasn't amazing. Uh, I think we need a really good running back in the 
off season honestly I've seen that's been our biggest weakness for sure it's just running uh, Cortland Sutton had a pretty good game uh, no fan of touchdown and Von Miller had two sacks Alalu had a sack but they got a lot of pressure so another pretty difficult game here as we're back down to 500 uh, if we win this game we're playing the Chargers game. If we lose, I'm simulating the Chargers game. And the next episode will be the off season. We got to win this one if we want to have a chance. Four in a row. In the first half, the offense was terrible. I don't know what's happening. Uh, we forced three turnovers and still lost. Um, Travis Lakes had an alright game. Josh Allen really played bad. Corlin Sutton had a really big game, but I don't know. Something about this team is just slowing us down. Only one sack for each team. AJ Boye and Justin Simmons each had interceptions. So, in an effort to see who might be, uh, pretty solid for the future I'm starting a couple of the younger guys I'm not starting everyone um, but guys I have questions on like KJ Hamler I'm starting them to see if they can have a big game in the last game uh, I don't believe there's a way we make the playoffs but you really never know uh, as we place the 8-7 and seven Chargers uh, in the last game of the year another loss the Defense this time was the reason we lost. They allowed 38 points. The offense didn't play great, but 38 points is a lot. Justin Herbert shredded us. Travis Lake threw a lot of yards, but threw an interception, only one touchdown. Gus Edwards didn't have a great game. Really, no one had a good game running. Uh, Brandon Ayuk had a huge game. Oh, my. Wow. KJ Hamler did have a good game. I started him. Um... So maybe he is the guy we look to bring back. And then Tim Jerrigan had a sack. And Bouye had a sack. So one thing I will do because usually after a team that you expect to make the playoffs doesn't. You might end up seeing a staff get fired. And I don't usually do this. But I'm going to. Because we definitely should have made the playoffs this year. And it, after that collapse I don't think... I don't think we can keep him around. I'm going to fire our head coach. It will end off on a good note. Travis Lakes has another upgrade. Um, and I'm going to put it into Improviser. Actually, yeah, I'm going to put it into Improviser again. Still says it's 76. Um, and that's all right. Um, but anyways, that will be the last or the last episode of this season next episode will be the off season so you want to stay tuned for that um but anyways thank you guys so much for watching i'm out peace